Welcome to the Passive Crypto Show. I'm your host, Ilgam Pearl. Just an average person sharing my experiences on how to make multiple streams of passive crypto income online. So feel free to watch for educational purposes and learn from my mistakes as well as benefit from my experiences. Now this episode is a bit different to what I usually do. This episode is about Cash Forex Group, also known as Cash FX Group, and this is not a review video, rather, this is a discussion video. Now, while doing research on Cash FX over the past few months, also checking YouTube, I've mainly come across two different types of videos on two sides of the extreme one being such positive reviews that you know the reviewers are doing literally everything and anything to try and pull you in and sign up under them and the other extreme is those who are just labeling it a scam and just you know calling it so many things and when you check the you know uh, video description all you see is them sharing their own website links or own program links and you know it even goes to the extent of some of them actually mentioning it in the video don't join cash effects it's a scam join my opportunity or my website or sign up to my email list etc so both types of videos you know i've watched them and to be honest i'm not a fan of either of them um one thing is you should never over promote something and secondly don't just label something a scam and then promote your own stuff i know that's a you know marketing technique or tactic but personally i find that unethical now today's discussion is cash forex group is it facing a cease and desist and if so what next now the reason why i raise this question let's you know go back to some old news which is this article which was you know issued in december if you look at the date it's 11 12 2019 which in uk date means 11th of december 2019 and this is you know as you can see on the official fca uh, website under the category of warnings and this warning was issued against cash fx group in the uk by the fca which is similar to basically the sec in the us or asic in australia etc now i'm not going to waste your time reading it you can have a look at it pause the video if need be but this had happened back in december and cash fx was still running normally and even till today and i actually just checked this before recording this video members from the uk are still able to register so on that front it's absolutely fine this article or warning by the fca from the uk has had no effect on stopping you know um cash fx allowing new members from the uk to still join so that's fine okay but then i came across this even more recently okay so the article is old news came across it in december and now this i came across very recently but I hadn't gotten around to you know making a video about it now as you can see it says we are currently accepting members from outside the united states now what does this mean that means cash fx is currently or no longer accepting new members from the us now what does that mean who knows you know there isn't any official statement or anything like that against cash fx from sec or anything like that but 
usually when businesses stop members from the US joining after initially having allowed them to join usually from what I've seen in the past is because they have received a cease and desist order or are fearful of receiving it due to you know the let's say volume of business they've been generating in the US and if that does end up happening then those businesses unfortunately you know none of them have actually survived every single one of them either exited or went bankrupt now I have many you know friends who are in cash effects both in the UK and in the US and I know there are a lot of you as well who are in the US that might not be members of cash effects yet so please confirm for me in the comments below whether you come across this page as well when trying to register with cash effects using anyone else's link because I don't have a you know link to share I'm not in this platform at the same time if you check the description I will not be promoting anything else in the description of this video because this video is solely a discussion of cash effects and I don't feel it, you know right for me to make a discussion on cash effects and then in the you know links or description or comments I'm sharing something else so that being said what you know what is my take on this at the moment well some of you already know I had been considering cash effects as an option for my portfolio to be added on okay and I had just been gathering the funds because members who have been you know with it for a while they recommended that if I do join join with at least the 1k package if I was to join with the 300 or the 500 package it's not really worthwhile I would be better off using that kind of money on other projects which is what I'm doing my other project which I'm involved in you know I've put in around way less let's say way less than $1,000 so if I was to go into this one I would have to go in with at least $1,000 for it to be worthwhile according to current members now with the current state of cash effects not allowing new members and from the US and I know that they have a legal team you know fantastic lawyers etc with that being said the previous companies which had gone through something similar they had a you know fantastic legal team but even then they were unable to pull through let me just give you one example without naming any names okay this certain you know opportunity or website had specifically stated in you know in their terms and conditions all the legal jargon that you can think of stating that it is not an investment etc um you are you know responsible for your own risk and liabilities and all that other stuff even then when they come you know came under the scrutiny of the sec sec was you know able to label them as a security or an investment and because they were not regulated under them they were issued with that cease and desist and down the company went so what would i say to members who are currently already in this as far as i know it is still paying and the members who are in the us who had previously joined they are still able to access their accounts and still are earning and making withdrawals so that is good news for them and i hope they keep on earning now as for you know whether they should purchase another package or make an upgrade in that regards my personal opinion is is if you've first of all broken even and then secondly made ROI keep on withdrawing don't feel that you know pressure or fear or greed to upgrade 
just to continue earning. If you have, you know, broken even and made ROI and you are continuing to earn, carry on, keep withdrawing that. Um, if you see this message, we are currently accepting members from outside the United States. Uh, this message disappear and it means they are continuing to accept new members from the US. I would say that is a good sign and that is a positive sign. And then and only then go and upgrade. Until then, me personally, I wouldn't upgrade. So, you know, if you are a member of this and you're in the US or whether or not you're not in the US, please let me know in the comments below what it is that you are planning to do or, you know, what you would do in this situation if you're not already a member of this opportunity. So that's all I have to share for you guys today. Something a bit different. And, you know, it's only out of concern for not just myself because I was considering it as a, you know, diversification of my portfolio, but also for my online friends who are already members of this. Okay. So I really hope you guys possibly, you know, enjoyed this video and hopefully benefited from it. So please like it and definitely, you know, share your thoughts in the comments below. And if you are new to this show, please, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell as this will most definitely help me grow from a small channel to hopefully a medium channel. And who knows, maybe eventually, you know, a big channel one day. That being said, thanks for listening, guys, and watching, definitely. Until next time, goodbye.